video will demonstrate on how to install the alloy disc onto Yamaha Y15ZR. First, position the vehicles on the stands and ensure that it is stable. To remove the front wheel, unscrew and remove the pin while holding the wheel steady. Once the front wheel is disconnected from the fork, rest it on a flat surface. Tap the surface of the screws using a hammer to disengage any screws that are seized. Loose all the screws connected between the disc and the rim and then remove the old disc entirely. Rest the new RCB S-Series alloy disc on the rim and align it to the screw holes appropriately. Insert the new screws and tighten them using a torque wrench. Dial the measurements of the wrench and turn the screws until they produce an audible click. Install a caliper bracket to extend the brake caliper. This is due to the size of the new discs that are much larger than the original. Once the disc installation is complete, the front wheel cannot be refitted to the vehicle. To remove the rear wheel, unscrew and remove the pin while holding the wheel. Push the wheel towards the vehicle to loosen the chain. Loose all the screws connected between the disc and the rim and then remove the old disc entirely. Rest the new RCB S-Series alloy disc on the rim and align it to the screw holes appropriately. Insert the new screws and tighten them using a torque wrench. Adjust the brake pads to make the wheel insertion easier. Expand the gap between the brake pads to make it easier to insert the wheels. Reinsert the chain and slide the pin into the wheel. Examine whether the brake calipers and the newly installed alloy discs are working properly. Adjust the wheel alignments to make certain that it is balanced and set the chain tension as prescribed by the manufacturer. Tighten the screws between the pin and the sprocket to secure the wheel. The vehicle is now ready for the road. For more info on RCB products, visit www.racingboy.com.my Stay tuned for our next installation videos.